need order in the audience because our next guest is one hot judge. I can't believe I just got away with that line. What a pun. Uh, no, she's one of our dear friends. She's uh, come by here quite often. Sometimes she even cooks and takes over the kitchen. Check her out in action at her real day job, though. Did you sign this? Um, that was my signature, yes, and I would have signed it. So if you signed it, did you read it? Um, no, I can't say that I did. So you just got this in the mail where it might have said, you are now owing us your firstborn and $10,000, and you said, let me just not read this and sign it. I would have lost my firstborn. <laughs> <laughs> did you ever say anything about $2,500? I have the email documentation to prove that she asked for three thousand. Now we're up to three thousand. If I ask you one more time, it's going to be ten thousand. Did you say three thousand? I feel like we're at an auctioneer. I did say three thousand. So the woman for three thousand dollars. <laughs> Margaret, Viva Las Vegas. What is going on? Thank you. How have you been, my friend? I'm doing great. I'm happy to be back, as always. I love being here. Enjoy being with you. I know. It's you. fun, right? It is. It's Your show is really fun, too, though. Like, we were all just watching that together. We were cracking up. Yeah. I guess I'd lost my firstborn. <laughs> Did it? I know. The things that people say are so unexpected. You must come up come to that yeah, all the time. I mean, it's just crazy. I know. I know. And we were wondering today, because the show can get so crazy, do you guys have bloopers? Have you ever cracked up in somebody's face or giggled or just lost it? Yes, on, on many occasions. No, seriously. Yeah. Oh, no, we really have, it you know. so crazy. And I'm more used to being comfortable laughing. We had a fellow come in, and he was, his case was very weak. And all he kept saying is, but I love Judge Domingo. And I didn't hear him at first, so I turned to... The, the judge next to me, to Tanya, and I said, what did he say? She goes, he loves you. I said, you love me? I said, I don't know if that's going to help you win or not. He goes, your voice, it's like butter. And I, feel, I hear myself like a, an Italian Barbara Streisand, you know, and he's saying to me, your voice, it's like butter, it's like butter. So ultimately, he loses. And in the end, when they interviewed him at the end of the show, they said, how did you feel losing? He said, I've got something more valuable than that. And he held up his dismissal, the case dismissed, with my signature on it. He goes, I have Judge Domingo's signature. Uh, make sure to watch Hot Bench. Check your local listings. Up next, what a shock, I'm in the kitchen.